Barba Brigade. Um, today we are going to do another update on my bikini prep. Um, I, I'm hoping by now, what would it be, the third video, that there's been a couple progress. Um, but we've been working really hard on the home workout and um, before quarantine. Then we open up again. Hopefully we don't close again because although home workouts were great, I love the metal. So here we are today. We're gonna work on squats. Um, I'm going for a top set of five for like a RP eight or nine. The warm ups felt good. Um, I I had to use the duffel bar, which is um, one. It weighs 52 pounds compared to the 45 pound normal bar. Um, so and then it's it's way longer and it's distributed um, at an angle, so it makes you go way lower. Um, just in case you think I went a little easy on the weight, um, but they felt really good. Um, the warm ups, I if you can tell, I'm kind of terrified of plates, full plates, 45 pound plates. Um, at least I try to tell myself that it's all mental, and even though eventually I'm gonna have the whole bar stacked, um, the, the whole duffel bar stacked with like tens, um, whatever works, um, trick the mind. So I, I got up to. Um, I ended up getting to a top set of 162. I was gonna call it there, um, and I was like, yeah, like that's it, you know, that's an eight. But then as soon as I looked at my program of last week and I did 162, I was like, no, you can't do the same weight. So I tried to go five pounds more, and uh, with the help of Stephanie, I ended up doing it great. Um, I, I think I a little bit struggled on the last rep, but, um, uh, yeah, I wasn't gonna let it go, especially when like you're being recorded. But it was good. It was good. It was good. Come on. Up. Bump back. Let's go. Up. Nice. There you go. That was fast. Up. There you go. The following exercise after that was um, single leg RDLs um, with the barbell and I ended up just sticking to the straight barbell of um, 45 pounds and didn't really add any extra weight to it because um, I, to be honest, I've never worked my hamstrings ever until pretty much recently when I hold, like started the bikini prep which was maybe a couple four or five months ago so before that they were completely non-existent um, so single leg RDL with a barbell at 45 pounds was brutal but they've been growing they've been growing we're having some um, what's it called progress on that so even though they hurt they they do their job flashback to a couple videos ago um, I, a couple months ago when we posted like the video of um, my first intro to how I became working here. Um, if you go back to it, uh, a lot of the comments were pretty mean in terms of um, people saying I had no ass. And you know what? Facts. Not even gonna come into it. I read them and I was like, you know what? The facts were spoken. I am cute. Just kidding. Just kidding. But what's it called? Uh, I didn't have a, an ass, you know. And um, for like bikini and everything like that, I kind of started feeling like. Okay, do I even have a chance, you know, um, in terms of like muscle definition? But I didn't let that bring me down. I, um, during the whole first closure around March, um, and I just started working with the band, um, I just kept doing my thing, you know, everything that Stanley kept um, uh, programming me. Um, and then I kept to my diet, and until recently, I will say, I think I'm getting a little definition. Just kidding, just kidding. But you know, it, it does feel kind of cool to finally see some quad pop, um, some hamstrings, um, especially. Um, it feels nice to finally see that I, I think I might actually have a chance. It's kind of cool because um, from the first video when like uh, I was like, yeah, you know, I'm gonna try bikini. Um, it was nice to finally have a goal to something because I powerlifting was never really like a strength of mine personally, um, but. So I've always liked high reps, so even today doing a top set of um, five reps for RP9, uh, um, it felt like a, maybe a little much in terms of like comparison to powerlifting for top single, but we are actually seeing some improvement and um, I don't know, it feels good, it feels good too. I don't know when there will be a show, I'm gonna be honest with you, I don't know when that's gonna happen anymore, so 
just stay tuned for that um, but I'm hoping for next year it's been great to at least know that all the work that I've been doing especially during this crazy time um, and like uncertainty too because um, that whole thing about not really knowing when there's a show could kind of put you down because it's like okay what am I really doing this for you know but then I like like see the progress I'm seeing within myself and I'm like at the end of the day you're doing this for yourself you know so it's it's a nice reassurance to be like okay yeah the shows aren't gonna happen but fuck am i looking good that's great you know and um even though like also wait too because i feel like i i sucked at squats you know and i feel like um i had no uh my glutes were yeah i had no ass in the sense but i also they weren't strong you know and i feel like that that Stanley kept telling me that like your glutes aren't strong and you have like a pretty weak back I, I was just like oh my god he's telling me I have no ass and like my back is weird you know but no it actually it, it actually you have to kind of look at it in the terms of just sport and actually see that you have a goal and there is a journey to get to it and um, one of the biggest things is just kind of figuring that out one why are you doing it are you just doing it to make a show and because there's like a video about it or are you actually doing it because you actually want to set get to your goal you know and i feel like this is um the leanest i've ever looked in my life so it's actually like oh shit it's possible you know especially being like bikini you know um before for me um and then during this uncertainty time to have like one thing that like you can focus on um because even if like the gyms close down again it's nice to know that that goal still remains even if i'm gonna go back home and like continue my band workouts um, the goal is still there because I'm doing it for me, you know? So, it's been great!